Yo, bro, I seen a whole bunch of demonic bitches outside yesterday. It was Halloween, my nigga. The same costumes every year, bro. Go chase a bag. These bitches work nine to fives to go to get into parties and buy licks. I know this song was one of the ones just by the flaw I'm making. I still know she could be my bitch when I'm dumb. She'll sing too. Bro, the world has to be ending, bro. That's good stuff. Yo, listen, let me talk to y'all niggas for a little bit while I roll my little swiffy. Hold on. This is, listen, just because it's not a spray pack don't mean that there's no Zion in that bitch. I hope y'all been taking care of yourselves. I don't want to talk to y'all like I'm soul Minati or anything. Niggas gonna call me a soul Minati dude. But nah, real shit though, bro. Don't ever chase money, chase freedom, and you'll have whatever you want in life, my nigga. But that's not why the f here, bro. We're here because it's November 1st and it's hot as I have a jacket on. I checked the weather report, my nigga. This shit said 62. 62 but it's supposed to be 59 all the way in the morning nigga it's 12 it's like 12 about to be one bro nigga it's hot as a b i'm not gonna lie but i can't take off my my coat because the coat match my drip my nigga nigga's gonna be like oh why don't you ever grind it bro you probably a broke ass nigga but sometimes it's better to roll with your fingers you know but yeah bro it's november 1st my nigga and it's hot as shit the world is ending Lil uzi just dropped his internal intake too that shit was straw guy doodle shit you want to know why it was straw guy doodle shit though it wasn't Thraga Doodoo shit because it was Thraga Doodoo shit. It was Thraga Doodoo shit because we was expecting more from him. We thought we was gonna hear the old Lil Uzi vert that we know and love, but I'm not gonna lie. Have you not seen that nigga's past few performances, my nigga? Let's go, let's go. Yes, 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 this nigga been worshiping demonic shit all the whole time. How is that your nigga and you allow this nigga to do that? I don't get it. Like, there's no girl in the world, I think, would allow you to support some demonic shit. And she's not demonic, my nigga. This nigga need to lock the fuck in and make some good music. All right, bro, y'all should have rolled the I should have already, bro. Don't take that fucking long. I'm, I asked myself, like, why did I think I got myself into smoking? Or why did I start smoking weed? I'm not going to lie, bro. It was strictly for the bitch. When I used to get around bitch. I was in high school, bitch smoking. I never used to smoke, bro. Think about it, bro. When you hit a bitch, bro, and you like, yo, you, yo, you trying to match? That's the only thing that these pothead bitches spawn to nowadays. If you want to match or smoke them up. I'm about to start being on my DDG shit and just start uploading long-ass vlogs that's unedited. Y'all want to see some unedited vlogs, bro? Tell me if y'all niggas want to see some unedited vlogs. Yo, I don't know who lighter this is. This is one of my man's lighters. I think I stole it by accident, bro. I'm going to give it back to you tomorrow. Shit just been going by, like, day by day. Like, you just realize, like, you don't fuck with nobody, bro. Like, you fuck with niggas, but you don't fuck with nobody. Like, nobody could, like, be on, like, the mental that you have because they're not in the same situation that you're in. Like, you fuck with them, but you don't, you can't fuck with them all the way because they don't understand, like, they don't understand the demons you got, nigga. So stop relying on people for happiness, bro. Yo, bro, I seen a whole bunch of demonic bitches outside yesterday. It was Halloween, my nigga. The same costumes every year, bro. Go chase a bag. These bitches work nine to fives to go to get into parties and buy licks. Stupid thoughts. All those bitches outside that are in demonic outfits and shit like that and outfits that's mad revealing. Don't think that they're cuffable, bro. Only dunk these bitches. These bitches only deserve to be dunked. These bitches do not deserve to be cuffed, bro. Y'all start cuffing the wrong bitches and then complaining how your life turned out. Nigga have a kid with that bitch. Nigga wondering why she put him on child support child support for five hundred out for five hundred thousand dollars every month, bro. Y'all niggas be like, oh, I don't know why my bitch treats me like this. Nigga, cause you found her at a team takeover party, dumbass. Like what the fuck? You not finding love in no fucking party, nigga. Go to Target. Feel me? Go back to a girl that used to have a crush on you in high school. Try to talk to her. I feel like, in my opinion, you should only talk to girls that like you first. Or at least like you. Don't try to convince a bitch to like you, bro. That's not P at all. There's a lot of niggas on this app that y'all niggas be trying to imitate, but these niggas don't get bitches. These niggas only got bitches because of the status that they're at before they really never had no bitches, bro. And they probably only had one girl that they really liked and the reason why they keep chasing bitches right now is because they fumbled them. They fumbled that one bitch that they really like because they let the they let the clout and shit and the money get to them. And they thought that they could get high caliber bitches. But high caliber when you talk to high caliber bitches, it comes with a lot of negative. 
this is the only bad thing about having a having recording with your iPhone, bro. Like, I, I, I always run out of storage and I always end up having to delete mad shit. Like, I can't just buy another cartridge. That's the only downfall of recording with your phone. But I feel like, like I said, everybody should start off with their iPhone because if you start off with your iPhone, bro, and you really get subby with this iPhone shit, and you get subby with editing on your iPhone, everything else in life is gonna be easier, bro, because you're persevering through the hardest difficulty. The hardest difficulty, bro. I'm telling you, bro. The hardest difficulty. Yo, to the spray demons and the yo, this generation is a bunch of spray demons, bro. If you don't got sprayed, these niggas think you not smoking za. These niggas need to be stopped. You telling me just because SpongeBob is on the top is on the front of your package, my nigga, you think you got za? You think you think because Sonic the Hedgehog, the Hedgehog toy is in a box with weed, you think you got za? You're fucking dumb. I'm not trying to be a bad influence at all, bro, because I know I have a younger audience, bro. Yeah. But. You know, I can never control a nigga. I can never control what a nigga really do. For me, I could just advise you and guide you, but I can never like really help you or do anything. I don't know none of y'all niggas. If y'all want niggas want to tap in with me and shit, y'all could definitely tap in with me and shit. But like, I advise you, number one rule, if you do start smoking, don't let nobody else roll your shit, bro. That shit will ruin your life. Like even your friends, your friends can roll your blunt and they, you don't even know that they envious of you and they fuck up your blunt, bro. Watch who you hanging around. If you're doing anything smoking wise, watch who you hanging around, bro. Do it in a controlled environment. Hey, yo, man, just see a little body man. A transformer. But I'm just taking the scenery right now, bro. Just enjoy your life, bro. Enjoy it while it's pure. Because as soon as you get out of high school, bro, your, your shit is not pure no more, bro. Your shit is not pure no more, bro. You're going to have to go through a lot of shit, a lot of, a lot of challenges you're going to have to do, you're going to face, bro. And you probably didn't even think that you would ever get in any of those circumstances that you're in. Real shit, bro, you're not going to think that you're ever going to get in those circumstances, but it might just happen to you. Just as God testing your, your willpower, your, 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 your mind is testing your body is testing your strength is this testing testing also your spirituality bro real shit i know y'all be just see me do goofy shit but like real shit, i'm a real ass nigga at the end of the day bro like i have feelings everybody has emotions and shit everybody deals with their emotions in different ways bro but all i'm gonna say is though bro that's just testing your might bro that's god testing your might in my, in my opinion, you don't even have to believe in God. Believe that you're God. Believe that's your brain and your spirituality testing you. That's what it really is. When you when you go through shit, when you go through shit, it's not because the, it's not always because of the devil, bro. It's not always because of the devil. Stop thinking that everything is a bad situation, bro. It's just testing you. Like I said, it's testing your might, your your willpower, your brain. Like for me, don't let nobody tell you, oh, you got time. You don't got you got time, bro. You don't got no time. I feel like as soon as you hit 12, you don't got no time. Bro. I ain't coming here to chat up your ears, but yeah, I might get some daily vlog content. Like I might get two uploads a day. I don't know how I'm feeling. For me, if I want to talk about some shit, but I used to do this on TikTok. I blew up off of TikTok off of just doing this, yapping, bro. I'm a fucking professional yapper, bro. That ass. But I got some bangers coming for y'all, though. Got some real bangers, bro. So stay tuned in. I might catch y'all niggas later, but I'm gonna post this video as a video.